Hello again, Luke Bug, the geek of steel here, and I'm back with an unboxing video. The awesome girls and guys at EMP UK asked me to have a look on their website and pick out a few items to review. And that wasn't easy, as their website is filled with stuff. They've got movie merchandise, music merchandise, lots of geeky stuff, toys, clothes and accessories. So... Let's dive into the box and see what I eventually chose. Always be careful when using scissors. And we are in. One can never have enough t-shirts. And if you just look on the EMP website, you will see that you are spoiled for choice because there is just a t-shirt for every fandom. So, let's see what I chose, and then we'll leave this curious item till last. T-shirt number one was this awesome Joker design. I love the colours on this one, and if you look closely, you can see Batman in the Joker's eye, and his logo in the tear. Now, of course, I had to choose something that had my superhero's emblem on, and this was the first item. Superman and the Stars and Stripes. But when you zoom out, you see the full image on that skull. I have seen most Superman designs on t-shirts, but um, never this one before. So I thought this was an interesting one to add to my collection. Another Batman t-shirt, Luke? Well, yes and no. This one is just too much fun. Based on the famous painting, The Scream of Nature, we have the Joker screaming away and the Batman looking menacing in the background and I'm sure this image is available online to buy as a poster because this would look good on any geeky wall and especially looks good on this t-shirt and this was the final t-shirt I chose the other ones were quite dark because I thought I needed some different colors in my wardrobe most of my t-shirts are primary blue navy blue dark blue or light blue so i thought i would mix it up a little bit but when i saw this blue t-shirt i had to have it striking colors and that simplistic man of steel usa design was really nice so uh it didn't take long for me to click on that one now that's the t-shirts let's find out what was in that final mysterious funko shaped box what could be inside well it's a funko but not just any Funko. And here she is. The Wonder Woman Amazonia EMP pre-release special edition. As many of you know, I do not like Funkos in their boxes. So I'm about to release her, but please do not be offended. And there she is in all her glory. And that's why I don't like Funkos in their boxes. Because you can't really see all the detail. Like... If I'd kept her in the box, you wouldn't see this gorgeous ponytail. I will find a very special place for Wonder Woman very soon. EMP UK, thank you so much for allowing me to choose a few geeky items to review. It took me quite a bit of time to choose these items because there is just so much variety on the website and you are quite literally spoilt for choice. There's movies, music, toys, comics, there's something there for every fandom, which is, is what I love about the site, because everybody can geek out about something. Um, with me, obviously, my main guy is Superman, but there is so much more choice on the website as well. And Funkos, yeah, they have got a lot of Funkos. Regular Funkos, rare Funkos. Funkos that normally would cost quite a lot of money to import, you can find on the EMP website. And sometimes you can pick up some chase items as well. So, one more time. EMP UK, thank you so much for these wonderful items. I will leave links for these below. And I'm going to go now and try and decide which t-shirt to wear today. I think I'm going to go for this one. I'm Luke, the Geek of Steel, and I'll be back soon.